welcome to the Island Honey Wine Company. My name is Charles. I would love it if you could come and visit us. I would enjoy sharing our farm with you. So I would like to tell you a little bit about how we manage the farm in the most sustainable way. Uh, we grow different kinds of fruit here, primarily the husk up, and we use animal power to give us all the fertility that we need in our fields. Every day, as soon as the spring comes, when the grass is starting to green, we fence off the, each row in our orchard, and every row is uh, like having a restaurant for one day for our sheep and our cattle. And our sheep and our cattle enjoy that. They're eating the grasses, the broad leaves, they're planting seeds with their hooves, and they're leaving fertility behind. And over seven years, we've been able to improve the amount of organic composition in the soil. We have much healthier soil, better water retention, uh, and it's enabled us to grow our fruit even when the weather is dry without irrigation. So that's how we use our animal partners to help us our fertility on the farm and you can see we have cows and sheep these are partners so these will these animals will uh, continue to live here and grow and thrive and we couldn't do uh, a good job of growing all this nice food without their help so when those sheep and the cows around the base of the plants, how they've manicured all around the plant and trimmed the grass. It's almost like bonsais. So these guys are gathering their nectar and pollen for the last, one of the last uh, weeks that they'll be able to gather food for winter. So they're busy, busy, working hard, getting ready so to store up all the supplies they need for winter. favorite things to do is introduce people to the world of mead. Now mead is made by fermenting the honey. It's the oldest form of wine in the world. And when we enjoy some mead, we're on a special journey. We take a journey through the glass on the back of a bee. Enjoy the journey. <laughs> 